what's up guys welcome back uh, as you can see we are getting us straight into day eight um, of our group stages here so the first game we have is the one between uh, kenya and wildcard 2 so let's have a quick look at the teams that we've got in the lobby so as you can see we've got the players there from team unknown over in slot 2 we've got the players from noobs with attitude in 3 we've got collision course over in slot 4 then of course we've got the players there from the terminators in slot 5 Hakuna matata over in 6 we've got the players from fear esports in slot 7 virus squad in 8 We've got the Toxic Rebels in 9. We've got Error over in slot 10. Then, of course, we've got the players there from the Squad Strippers in slot 11. Be prepared. In 12, we've got the Originals. In 13, we've got the Dark Lords ascending behind enemy lines over in slot 14. Then, of course, we've got the players from Smuts Empire in slot 15. In 16, we've got the team there from um, MW. I'm not sure if that's most wanted, but let's go for that. And then in slot 17, we've got the players there from Next Level Esports. So yeah, welcome to today's matches. Um, if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button, hit the like. And don't forget to turn on the notification button. Also, a quick shout out to the sponsors. You'll see them right above my head here. So that is, of course, Bandar Bing. The guys working on the graphics that you saw before we got the match started. But there we go. So let me know in chat who you guys are here to support. As you can see, we've got quite a few teams in the lobby. 16 teams, 59 players in total. So uh, yeah, it's going to make for an interesting round. Let's see how it goes. We've got a few teams already now making their way over to La Cobrera. So hopefully we can jump into some early action. The players there from Team Unknown as well as Fear now heading straight over to El Pozo. So that might also be an interesting spot to jump into. So let's see, let's see, let's see. Now just weekly waiting. Keeping an eye on the players, of course, there from Makuna Matara. They've already touched down. We've got a few more teams now making their way down. That being the players there from MW and ERA, as well as the guys from Noob with the Noobs with Attitude. So let's jump straight up into the Noobs with Attitude over here. As you can see them, of course, now moving around. Already trying it to get a little bit of loot. We've got MW, of course, now landing right there in front of them. And then also on the other side, we've got the players there from Team Unknown as well as the team from Fear over in El Pozo. So now just keeping a watchful eye on the teams, trying to see who's going to give us the first push. Seems like Noxie already armed up. Well, got the Scar L equipped there. So let's see. Let's have a quick look at the map as well. You've got a few teams over in Picardo, a few more teams over in uh, San Martin, that being Collision Course and the Smuts Empire team. You've got Next Level and the players there from um, that is the Behind Enemy Lines team now holding up in Picardo. So we already got a few shots right there between Collision Course. So let's try and jump across over towards them on the right hand side. And now let's check on the left. We've got the players here from Team Unknown, of course, now also moving up. Let's go over to Mumu. As you can see, Mumu now just upstairs in the Coliseum there, making the way around. And of course, the Collision Course team on this side. So hopefully, we're going to see a little bit of action now between Ghost and Dami. Dami right there in front of Ghost. So hopefully, hopefully, um, they're going to start pushing in. So Smuts Empire, they've gone for a weird spread though. We've got them spread out across the region. Uh, it might put Dami in a bit of a bit of trouble there, but um, yeah, we're also keeping an eye on the players over in Picardo, seeing how it goes. Hopefully, we can try and jump in. So yeah, let's see what let's see if we can maybe jump over to Dami. Dami, of course, now being right in front of us over here. Ooh, okay, so Dami is definitely heading up with the rest of the team there. They're of course now slowly but surely making their way out. As you can see, two of the players heading down over the ridge. And of course, looks like Dami might be heading over to Hacienda del Patron. So just checking what we've got going on over in Picardo. The players here from Team Unknown on the left-hand side still making their way around. The team from behind enemy lines, of course, now, as you can see over here. Also, just getting some loot. I haven't seen any shots just yet in Picardo. But hopefully, we're going to see a little bit of action anytime soon. So yeah, there we go, 16 teams. So we get a few shout outs of course now in the chat. Going out to the players there from Fear. So let's see, hopefully, hopefully they'll give us some action early on in the game. We've got the players there from the Toxic Rebels and the Squad Strippers also now pushing up on each other. So we're jumping in to there, keeping the angle over here with Team Unknown. 
Just waiting for those shots now as we've got the players from Fear right there in front of them still. So let's see, we got Zodiac now going up. Is he going to pick up the 8 scope or did he just mark it? No, jump straight over it. So Mumu of course now keeping a watchful eye. Mumu knows the players from Fear are just in front of them there. But uh, yeah, trying to not, you know, stand out in the open and try and take shots. You know, moving from cover to cover. There we go. So some of the Fear players there in the blue bottom, I think that is um, N1. So let's see now, maybe the team here from um, the Toxic Rebels might just get hit now by the team there from the squad strippers moving up right behind them. You can see them now just pushing up bit by bit. We got the red zone also in play now. So let's see if we jump in to this. Hopefully, uh, Jabro might get hit on the way in. We got Boolean and Dan the Ripper right there with him as well. So let's see, let's see. Hopefully, we're going to get the shots early on. So you can see it's just these two teams that we've got here at the moment. No one else really pushing up. we got Dan the Ripper now moving up. He, I think he kind of spotted them. He's got no bag though. So that is a, an interesting way of looting it up. Jabro now just on the outside. Shots about to fly across. Come on, let's see. Is Dan going to start the fight? Hopefully he does. Hopefully he does. Come on, Dan, you can do it. Okay, so it seems like Dan is just waiting for the remainder of the squad now to push up. You've got a little bit of action over here, of course, now with the placing team. Oh no, you can see Fear now just getting hit. I think that's nil or N1, whichever way. Oh, what a hit by Momo getting the knock. Well done. We've got a few more shots now, of course, here from the Toxic Rebels also now flying across. You can see them now just trying to get the hits in there. We got Jabro now keeping an eye there. M14, yes. So Auto now pushing up as well. Auto Prime. <laughs> Shufan running himself over. Oh man, that is a very that's that's that that kind of sucks. That kind of sucks. <laughs> um, yeah, it's happened to me a few times trying to hit the reload button and then you hit the exit button. By accident. I don't know what the case was there, but yeah, I've seen that happen way too many times. We've got the team, of course, here now from Kuna Matara up in um, Cabrera. So let's try and jump over to Kuna Matara and see if we can maybe get in on some of the action they've got going on over there. So we got Sitch over here now. Let's see. we got Nakshi. we got Karam and um, Kabi. Let's go for... Yeah, let's call it Kabi. There we go. So you can see them, of course, now pushing up. Ooh, next level right in front of them. That's on next level. Sorry, that's Noobs of Attitude. So we got Jeff from the Noobs of Attitude right in front of them. There are a few shots now still flying up here from Jabro. Still heading over towards the players there from the squad strippers. The Hakuna Matara team now getting ready to move up. Prison also getting knocked out by his own vehicle there. Ooh, it seems like we've got something happening here today with the teams jumping out of their vehicle a bit prematurely. Jeff now getting hit there by Cabby. Shots flying up. Beautifully done. Kuna Matara now pushing up. Let's see if we can jump over to Karam. They're all, of course now all just pushing up. Sitch now trying to come around the corner. Getting the hit in. Up comes Nakshi. What a flank. Gets the hits done. But Nakshi now also getting knocked out in the process. Nades getting that hit in on him there. Beautifully done. So let's just have a quick look, see if we got any other teams. No, it doesn't seem like that. Let's jump over to the players, of course, now here from um, the Noobs with Attitude. So we've got Akuna Matara on the left-hand side, Noobs with Attitude on the right. We've got Nades and Mizzy, or Mize. So let's see, let's see, let's see. Hopefully, they're going to give us uh, a nice little show. So far, they haven't been doing too bad, though. Ooh, up comes the green there from Karam, striding, flying straight over towards Nades. So Nades getting hit with some nades. Hits the side of the window as he's trying to send that one across. But doesn't make it all the way. There we go. Shots now flying up. Nades making a quick run for it. Trying to push up into the compound. We got Sitch. Of course, now as you can see on the side here. Getting ready to push up. Nades just holding up behind the container. Ooh, shots now flying across. Up comes Sitch. Is he going to take the hit? Oh, nice. And he does. So Mizzy now the last one left. Sitch quickly going in for the first there. Beautiful work. We got Nakshi now. Might get hit by Mizzy. Let's see. We got a, a, a quicker frag and they are now flying up. 
There we go. So that is a very clear indicator as to where Mizzy is. So they don't have to go searching. Oh, we got Cavi now pushing up as well. Let's see. Will Cavi get the hit? Up comes Cavi flying around the corner. Yes. And takes them down. Well done. News with attitude. Getting sent back to the lobby with some attitude there. So well done to the players here from Akuna Matata. Beautifully done. Let's try and jump over to the players here from um, behind enemy lines. They're, of course, now just still there, um, of course, in Picado with the players there from the next level esports. So I haven't seen much action in Picado just yet. Team Unknown, of course, now busy making their way up. We've got Collision Course holding up in San Martin. The Dark Lords also now starting to push in. So let's see if we can jump over here to the players from next level. Maybe we can get in on the fight between them there. So we got Perrin, Hitman, Juice, and BTS, the players there for next level. Hakuna Matata, of course, now just enjoying their loot. Ooh, there we go, Smuts. Ooh, maybe they're going to run themselves over again. And Caesar now might get pushed as well by the players there um, from the originals. So let's have a quick look here. Let's see, maybe Ain Caesar might get a clutch play. No idea, but let's see. Going up solo versus a full squad. The remainder of the team, Shafan and Syk, both being elsewhere on the map. So next level, just holding their space. Not moving up too much. Let's see, can we maybe jump over to the players here from Team Unknown? They're of course now right up on the hit, uh, right up on the ridge. And of course, we've got the players there from Collision Course, as you can see, just in front of Noxie. So NCs are about to push up on the players there from the original. So hopefully you're going to see a little bit of action and not just a quick wipe by the originals. So let's see what's Noxie going to do. Are we going to get, a get are we going to get a few hits? Let's just cycle through the players here. So we got Scream, Warlord, Noxie, and Mumu. Ooh, and Caesar now opting to go for the vehicle. That is definitely going to draw a bit of attention, but that vehicle is so wide and low that it can't really clear the ridge. So let's see, are the shots going to fly across over to and Caesar on the side here? Not sure. I think he's maybe trying to. Oh, yes, there we go. I don't know if he was uh, trying to lure them out or whatever the case was, but it definitely happened. And we got a Warlord, of course, now on the side, as you can see there with his AK with the suppressor on and also the M4. Thanks, Ben. Thanks for the subscript. For, thanks for subscribing, dude. Much appreciated. So let's see. Let's see. Hopefully we can get in on the action here between Team Unknown and Collision Course. And Caesar now getting pushed. The original's moving up on his position. He is now trying to make a run for it. Let's see. Is he going to try and get away? Or will he turn around and fight? No idea. We will find out in, a, in, in due time. So, so far he hasn't had much luck with the vehicles. Picking one of the longest vehicles and getting stuck. And now going for one of the slowest ones we've got on the map. But he manages to make his way out safely. All right, now let's see. We've got the team, of course, now there from MW. Now just pushing up behind him as well. Ooh, let's see. Will Prison start engaging? So they're definitely moving up, trying to get a good angle on him there. But it seems like he's managed to get away. Hopefully, they're going to push up on their on, on the players, of course, now from the original. So we have just over towards the southeast there. So Team Unknown now making them move up in towards Zone. Zone having shifted up once again. The players there from um, the squad strip is now slowly but surely making a push up in to uh, the team there from the squad strippers. Oh, the virus. So virus, of course, being over in Impala. So let's see, will they make it all the way there? Hopefully they're going to get a nice little push with a few hits going off as well. So MW, I'm not pretty sure what they're getting up to, but they're definitely trying to set up i think kind of maybe a i don't know like a gatekeep option there um yeah it's not working too great just yet but maybe it will work a little bit later on let's jump over to impala now where we've got the players here from the squad strippers just making their way around that was a bit of a weird yeah okay so we got auto prime now on uh, on the view over here so let's see let's see hopefully we can jump up we got the team from MW, of course, now moving out. And we got a few shots there from Fear firing away at Collision Course as they are now also trying to push up in towards zone. So 
the collision course as you can see now just pulling up here in to Minas Generales. Let's see, will they get it? Collision course. Alright, so they're about to make it up in towards zone. No idea if they're going to engage with the team to their north. And the squad strip is now pushing up right on the team here from Virus. Let's see, will they get it? We got Creeper, as you can see, of course, just off to the side there. Squad strip is slowly but surely making their way through the compound here, trying to get a good position. So let's see, on the other side, who do we have? Ooh. So behind enemy lines also now moving up. We got the Toxic Rebels and the players there from the Terminators also fairly close together. So hopefully we can jump up just waiting to see if there's going to be any shots. Right, so behind enemy lines, I don't know if they just crashed into the building or what happened, but they are definitely moving up. Oh, thank you so much for the sub there, Okoro. Much, much appreciated. So the squad strippers, of course, now as you can see, are still making their move, trying to get that push up on the virus team. I think they have their suspicions of the team being there. You can see the, the positioning we've got there for virus also suggests that they kind of know that there's someone with them. Um, I don't think that they know necessarily where they are, but I mean, they've got their angles pretty well covered over here. As you can see, we've got Albino and a few more teams, or a few more players. Um, we've got Hunter, Rota, and Creeper. Of course, now, as you can see, just positioned over there. We've got a few more shots now between MW now engaging with a few teams here that, of course, being the originals. So we're kind of waiting for that fight to break out. The originals, of course, as you can see, just off in the distance there. We've got Prison and... Uh, Abe now pushing up. Let's see. Will they get this? Trying to use the the smoke that the team there from the originals had dropped down. Oh, shots now going off. Ghost getting knocked. Down goes Fury and Prison. The remainder of the squad now moving in from the side. We got Claws and a Radioactive there. Let's see. Will they get their heads? We've got a Grand flying in. Oh, Rebel just going off the side. Gets a beautiful knock there. Radioactive getting hit. Claws is now the last hope for left. So behind enemy lines also now just trying to find a good position on this side here. No idea if they know that there's any teams nearby. But there we go. The originals getting it taken out by MW. Beautifully done. But MW now of course about to get pushed there by the teams from um, Team Unknown. You can see them just up on the ridge. Momo already getting ready to move in now. And also the team from Next Level Esports moving up as well behind enemy lines now just holding up in their position here. Let's try and jump over and see if we can get in on any of the action that is now taking place aside from the angle that we're watching from over here. So we got the team there from Next Level just up on the ridge right behind the players from Team Unknown. Unknown of course now starting the fight with them as well. So let's see. Let's see, so Mumu now keeping an eye over towards the players there from MW. We got Rebel just in the smoke. Next level now rather deciding to move out. It's not worth the effort or worth the fight. What a hit there. Mumu getting a beautiful hit there on MW, taking them out bit by bit. We got Warlord of course now firing away at the players there from next level as they're trying to move up into the safe zone. And now the squad strippers are also now starting to battle it out with the team of course here from Virus. They are left with one player. Boolean is the last one. Let's see, will he make it? He's of course, uh, I don't know where he went though. Because I don't think he's with the teammates. No, he left the rest of the squad and moved up. Oh, I don't think they like him too much at the moment. But yeah, we've got him now trying to push up into towards zone. You can see the remainder of the squad now all getting thirsted. Everyone is out. We got the Dark Lords, of course, now right in front of Boolean here. Let's see. Will they take the shots? Send the whole squad then back to the lobby. Well, what's left of it? Because we only got one left. So let's see. Bullion now trying to make a successful push into zone. So he's not stopping on the edge of zone, but in fact pushing in even further. So players from Team Unknown, of course, and as you can see, setting up, setting themselves up very, very nicely on the hill here. We've got a few more teams now. Let's jump over to behind enemy lines. They're, of course, now moving up on the team there from the Terminators. Let's see, let's see. Just waiting for it to load in behind enemy lines now. Trying to find an angle on the team. 
So we got Ed of whatever. That guy. <laughs> West off on the side here. Devil and Kingpin. The two of them, well, yeah, the players just bobbing around there. Ooh, there we go. The Terminator is now pushing up into towards zone. Off they go, rotating out. Let's see, will behind enemy line start the engagement? Oh, come on, come on. Alright, so they're firing off several shots. Doesn't seem like any of the hits are landing as they had hoped. Ooh, nicely done. So the players there from next level also now getting a hit on the Dark Lords. Well done. Let's see if we can jump up a little bit more. So the Dark Lords fairly spread out very close to the drop though. We got next level now getting ready to move in as well. So Smuts now trying it to get up into towards zone. Let's see if we jump over to next level. What is going to happen? Team Unknown in a very good position up on the hill here. BTS getting that quick first on Kenny. Beautifully done. I'm not sure why it's stuttering this much, but whatever. Let's just go with it. So the Virus Squad, of course, now pulling up here. Just in front of the players there from Team Unknown. So hopefully we're going to see the shots now flying across. The players, of course, also there from um, the Dark Lords. We have just north of the team here from um, next level. Oh, there we go. The Toxic Rebels now getting a hit in as well. Let's see if we can find them and hopefully jump up into what they're doing. Oh, we don't seem to see anyone close to them. But we got the players, of course, now from Team Unknown also firing off over at uh, the players here from next level that we've got on the left hand side hopefully we're going to see a fight here between the team there from um, that being the squad strippers and error now pushing up right behind them but bullion of course is the last one left so i don't know uh, how much of a fight he's going to put push uh, put up against the team there but we'll find out soon enough he's of course now also trying to make his way in the zone Trying to stay out of harm's way and get as as uh, as highly placed as he can. Squad strip is currently sitting on zero kills. Oh, there we go. Collision course getting a beautiful hit in as well. Taking out the players there. Well done. Fear getting a... Well, one or two of the players from Fear getting hit in the process. So we got Bullion, of course, now pushing up towards next level. He's fairly close to them. Not sure if he's going to get hit at, at all, but we'll find out in due time. Going for a boat. But why? Okay. Okay. So let's jump over to the Dark Lord. See what they're getting up to. We got the players there from Fear right in front of them. Next level now also busy engaging. Let's see if we can jump over to next level. We have just in front of us. They of course just took out the players there from the Terminators. Well done. Blowing up the vehicle. Setting up a beautiful ambush here. As the teams of course now try and make their push up into a zone. You can see the shots just flying across the team there of course. Now from behind enemy lines just moving up in front of them. Let's see. We got Juice of course now tapping off several shots. There we go. They got two players knocked so far. Oh man, this is going to be a close one. Let's see if we can jump up to behind enemy lines. So we, got, we just... And uh, who else left? There we go. So Devil is knocked. Ooh, they're down to one player. Let's see. Virus might now even push up on them. Team Unknown are just flying past the Dark Lords over here. So we got Smeagol and Deadshot. I'm not sure what uh, Smeagol is getting up to. He's in a very strange position. I think he went AFK. Oopsie. Ah, oh, comes next level. Gets another thirst. Beautiful hit there. Um, Hitman getting knocked out with that Mark 14. Everyone now slowly but surely making their way up in towards zone. As you can see, them all pushing in. We got Unknown also rotating up in towards zone. Oh, this is going to be one crazy fight. Smuts Empire now just trying to take a few shots off there at uh, Noxie. And down goes the team from behind enemy lines. Well done to next level. Beautifully played. Let's jump over to Fear and see what they are getting up to. So we can see them just holding up in the compound here as well. Noxie getting that hit in on Psyche. So Shifan now also moving up as well as Ain Caesar. Alright, so there's nothing happening with Fear. Fear just uh, being quite passive, not pushing up. Ooh, they might get the hits in on Team Unknown. Not sure why they're scared to fight, but we have the players from Akuna Matara now pushing up right here on Fear as well. So hopefully, hopefully they're going to start fighting 
Because it's about time. They're sitting on zero kills and they kind of need it. Let's jump over to Lens and see what's going on. So nothing with Lens, nothing with Hound, nothing with Pixel. They're just lying in wait, hoping for the players to move in. And Caesar getting hit by Molly. Up comes Noxy, putting up a few shots. We got Safan now also getting a Shafan there, getting a quick hit on screen. Let's see, he's of course trying to move around the side. Pixel getting hit by that Grin. That's what happens when you stay stationary for too long. Scream getting thirsted. Noxie now moving up. Oh, what a hit by Shafan. Gets the hit. Nicely done. Team Unknown down to two players. Now Shafan getting hit. One hit away from getting sent back to the lobby. And Warlord comes in and sends him back. Well done. We got Fear now battling it out here with the Kuna Matara. You can see the shots, of course, now flying all over the place. We got Warlord now once again getting ready to move in. Fear getting taken out by Kuna Matara. Well done. Akuna Matara not out of the woods just yet. We got the players there from the Dark Lords also just down below. So let's see. Hopefully they're going to start. Uh, well, hopefully they'll push up. We got the Toxic Rebels now moving up on the players here from Collision Forces. You can see Josh and Crow just up ahead. We got Schmiggle and Deadshot now getting ready to push for zone. Will they make it? Lots of uh, utilities being used here by the Toxic Rebels. They're pretty much a, a duo versus, I think it's duo versus squad. Team Unknown, of course, just off in the distance in front of the Dark Lords here. I don't know what Schmeagol is doing. I don't know if he's waiting for something or waiting for someone. But, uh, yeah, they definitely going to have to move anytime soon. So we got Ghost, of course, now trying to come up with a nice flank here on the player. Sends a green. Oh, what a green. Covering amazing distance there. So we are left with eight teams, 25 players. So let's hope the team here from Kuna Matara starts pushing up on the Dark Lords here. So we've got Nakshi, of course, now doing exactly that. Heading in. Oh, beautifully done. Gets the hit there on Deadshot. Ghost now also tr still trying to find an angle on this side. Schmeagol about to get hit. Let's see. Will Nakshi get it done? Will they send them back? Toxic Rebels now battling it out with the collision course. Ah, Smeagol gets taken out. Well done to Akuna Matara. Beautifully done. And down goes the team, of course, from the Toxic Rebels. Collision course sending them back to the lobby. So we are now left with six teams. We've got Virus, of course, now moving up on the players there from Team Unknown. They enjoying some of the loot right there on the drop. Akuna Matara quickly trying to heal up before moving on. You can see the players, of course, now there from next level moving in, blowing up their vehicle. Virus also keeping a watchful eye there on next level. I don't know if they've spotted the players from Team Unknown. But let's see, let's see. Akuna Matara now sending out a few smokes. Oh, there we go. Akuna Matara now pushing in. Shots all over the place. Team Unknown really going at it. Ripping it through the players. Era getting hit as well. Oh, man. Warlord is nearly down. Mumu is the last hopeful if he gets killed. Let's try and jump over to Mumu. So no idea. Hopefully, hopefully they're going to get a nice hit. Akuna Matara now just holding up. Trying to stay out of... Um, harm's way with collision course of course right there with them so let's see we got Karam now quickly healing up Nakshi also not doing too great Sage seems to be okay with health so team unknown caught in a very tough spot here several teams are now moving up on their position so let's see will they be able to uh pull off yet another clutch they're already sitting on seven kills Hakuna Matara sitting on nine kills the good shots now flying across. Nakshi getting ready to push. Collision course getting hit a little bit there. You can see Crow also getting hit. So yeah, that is a... That's a bit of a tough one. Oh, we got some shots now flying across. Nicely done. Next level hitting it up on Akuna Matara. Up they come moving in bit by bit. Karam and Nakshi, the last two hopefuls left. Collision course, of course, also right there in front of them. Shots now flying in from error. 
So what a nice, what a night nice circle this is. We got shots coming in from all directions. Akuna Matara now trying to outrun the blue zone. Garam getting knocked out. Let's see, will Nakshi make it? Nakshi is now running up. Oh, there we go. There we go. Akuna Matara getting taken out. Collision course now also just picking off players as they try to move up into a zone. Play zone getting in a nice few hits there. Team unknown also getting in a few hits as well. So let's see, let's see. Will they get an error now moving up on collision course right in front of us here. Down goes error. Well done. Five teams remaining. Collision course and team unknown now also exchanging a few shots. You can see Akuna Matara and Nakshi just managing to make it up into towards zone. You got Warlord and Momo just holding up in the building. BTS and Hitman now also trying to rotate up the side of zone. Coming into the safe zone there. Let's see, will Akuna Matara be able to pull this off? Collision course now also having to move up into towards zone. Not a lot of space left in the zone. Momo now also just tapping away there. Let's see, will BTS make it into zone? Well, it seems like they already are. Collision course just on the outside of zone. Getting ready to move in. Nakshi getting hit and damaged by the blue zone at the same time. So BTS now and Hitman also just are hiding behind the vehicles. Pretty good cover. Oh, down they go. BTS coming in with a beautiful hit. Nicely done. So let's jump over to collision course now. They're of course trying to move up into towards zone. You can see them coming in from the western side. Team unknown holding up right on the edge. Mumu pushing in, pushing up on next level. Down goes Mumu. Warlord now coming in for the push, heading in. Third fight is all the way. Warlord about to get hit. Just managing to drop down, but Hitman takes him out. Beautifully done. So now we have Collision Course going up against the players here from next level. Let's see, will they be able to get this chicken dinner? Collision Course sitting on 6 kills. We got next level on 17 kills. So will next level end up with 20 kills or will we have Collision Course finishing their play on 8? Let's find out. Let's find out. So next level now getting ready with the smoke, sending it up all over the place. Ooh, we've got a few hits coming in over towards Hitman. You can see Ghost and Josh getting ready to push. Oh, what a grin there by Josh. Gets the hit on BTS. Up comes Ghost getting ready to push in now. Come on. And the network goes all wonky right there. Come on, who's going to get it? Oh, and just like that, they land the final blows. Well done. So there we go. There we have it. You can just hear the celebration shots in the background. So well done to Collision Course. Getting the chicken dinner there, of course. Next level, finishing their play on 17 kills. Well done. Uh, we've got the players from Team Unknown also coming in with 8 kills in 3rd place. Akuna Matara in 4th. We've got Virus in 5th place. We've got Error in 6th place. We've got the players there from the Toxic Rebels finishing off in 7th. The Dark Lords in 8th. we got Fear in ninth place. Smuts Empire in 10th. The Behind Enemy Lines coming in in 11th place. The Squad Strippers in 12th place. The players there from the Terminators finishing in 13th, MW in 14th, um, then of course the Originals going out in 15th place, as well as the players there from the Noobs with Attitude going back to the lobby first. So well done, well played to the teams. Um, we've got another round coming up, that one of course being the game between Zimbabwe and Tanzania. So be sure to tune in in about 5 minutes time as we get ready for that one. Tapping off several shots. There we go. They got two players knocked so far. Oh man, this is going to be a close one. Let's see if we can jump up to behind enemy lines. So we, got, we just saw we had Kingpin and uh, who else left? There we go. So Devil is knocked. Ooh, they're down to one player. Let's see, Virus might now even push up on them. Team Unknown are just flying past the Dark Lords over here. So we got Smeagol and Deadshot. I'm not sure what uh, Smeagol is getting up to. He's in a very strange position. I think he went AFK. Oopsie. Ah, oh, comes next level, gets another thirst. 
Beautiful hit there. Um, Hitman getting knocked out with that Mark 14. Everyone now slowly but surely making their way up in towards zone. As you can see, them all pushing in. We got Unknown also rotating up in towards zone. Whoa, this is going to be one crazy fight. Smuts Empire now just trying to take a few shots off there at uh, Noxy. And down goes the team from behind enemy lines. Well done to next level. Beautifully played. Let's jump over to Fear and see what they are getting up to. So we can see them just holding up in the compound here as well. Noxy getting that hit in on Psyche. So Shufan now also moving up as well as Ain Caesar. Alright, so there's nothing happening with Fear. Fear just uh, being quite passive, not pushing up. Ooh, they might get the hits in on Team Unknown. Not sure why they're scared to fight, but we have the players from Akuna Matara now pushing up right here on Fear as well. So hopefully, hopefully they're going to start fighting because it's about time. They're sitting on zero kills and they kind of need it. Let's jump over to Lens and see what's going on. So nothing with Lens, nothing with Hound, nothing with Pixel. They're just lying in wait, hoping for the players to move in. And Caesar getting hit by Molly. Up comes Noxy, putting up a few shots. We got Safan now also getting uh, Shafan there, getting a quick hit on screen. Let's see, he's of course trying to move around the side. Pixel getting hit by that Grin. What happens when you stay stationary for too long? Scream getting thirsted. Noxy now moving up. Oh, what a hit by Shafan. Gets the hit. Nicely done. Team unknown down to two players. Now Shafan getting hit. One hit away from getting sent back to the lobby. And Warlord comes in and sends him back. Well done. We got Fear now battling it out here with Akuna Matara. You can see the shots, of course, now flying all over the place. We got Warlord now once again getting ready to move in. Fear getting taken out by Akuna Matara. Well done. Akuna Matara not out of the woods just yet. We got the players there from the Dark Lords also just down below. So let's see. Hopefully they're going to start. Uh, well, hopefully they'll push up. We got the Toxic Rebels now moving up on the players here from Collision Forces. You can see Josh and Crow just up ahead. We got Schmigel and Deadshot now getting ready to push for zone. Will they make it? Lots of uh, utilities being used here by the Toxic Rebels. They're pretty much a, a duo versus, I think it's duo versus squad. Team Unknown, of course, just off in the distance in front of the Dark Lords here. I don't know what Schmeagol is doing. I don't know if he's waiting for something or waiting for someone. But, uh, yeah, they're definitely going to have to move anytime soon. So we got Ghost, of course, now trying to come up with a nice flank here on the player. Sends a grin. Oh, what a grin. Covering amazing distance there. So we are left with 8 teams. 25 players. So let's hope the team here from Akuna Matata starts pushing up on the Dark Lords here. So we've got Nakshi of course now doing exactly that. Heading in. Oh beautifully done. Gets the hit there on Deadshot. Ghost now also tr still trying to find an angle on this side. Schmeagle about to get hit. Let's see will Nakshi get it done. Will they send them back? Toxic Rebels now battling it out with the collision course. Ah, oh, Smeagol gets taken out. Well done to Akuna Matara. Beautifully done. And down goes the team, of course, from the Toxic Rebels. Collision course sending them back to the lobby. So we are now left with six teams. We've got Virus, of course, now moving up on the players there from Team Unknown. They're enjoying some of the loot right there on the drop. Akuna Matara quickly trying to heal up before moving on. You can see the players of course now there from next level moving in blowing up their vehicle virus also keeping a watchful eye there on next level i don't know if they've spotted the players from team unknown but let's see let's see akuna matara now sending out a few smokes oh there we go akuna matara now pushing in Shots all over the place. Team Unknown really going at it. Ripping it through the players. Error getting hit as well. Oh man. Warlord is nearly down. Mumu is the last hopeful if he gets killed. Let's try and jump over to Mumu. So no idea. Hopefully, hopefully they're going to get a nice hit. Akuna Matara now just holding up. Trying to stay out of... Um, harm's way with Collision Courser, of course, right there with them. 
So let's see, we got Karam now quickly healing up. Nakshi also not doing too great. Sedge seems to be okay with health. So Team Unknown caught in a very tough spot here. Several teams are now moving up on their position. So let's see, will they be able to uh, pull off yet another clutch? They're already sitting on 7 kills. Hakuna Matara sitting on 9 kills. They got shots now flying across. Nakshi getting ready to push. Collision course getting hit a little bit there. You can see Crow also getting hit. So yeah, that is a... That's a bit of a tough one. Ooh, we got some shots now flying across. Nicely done. Next level hitting it up on Akuna Matara. Up they come moving in bit by bit. Karam and Nakshi, the last two hopefuls left. Collision course, of course, also right there in front of them. Shots now flying in from error. So what a nice, what a nice circle this is. We got shots coming in from all directions. Akuna Matara now trying to outrun the blue zone. Karam getting knocked out. Let's see, will Nakshi make it? Nakshi is now running up. Oh, there we go. There we go. Akuna Matara getting taken out. Collision course now also just picking off players as they try to move up into a zone. Play zone getting in a nice few hits there. Team Unknown also getting in a few hits as well. So let's see, let's see. Will they get an error now moving up on collision course right in front of us here. Down goes error. Well done. Five teams remaining. Collision course and Team Unknown now also exchanging a few shots. You can see Akuna Matara and Nakshi just managing to make it up in towards zone. You got Warlord and Momo just holding up in the building. BTS and Hitman now also trying to rotate up the side of zone. Coming in to the safe zone there. Let's see, will Akuna Matara be able to pull this off? Collision course now also having to move up in towards zone. Not a lot of space left in the zone. Momo now also just tapping away there. Let's see, will BTS make it into zone? Well, it seems like they already are. Collision course just on the outside of zone. Getting ready to move in. Nakshi getting hit and damaged by the blue zone at the same time. So BTS now. And Hitman also. Just hiding behind the vehicles. Pretty good cover. Oh, down they go. BTS coming in with a beautiful hit. Nicely done. So let's jump over to collision course now. They're of course trying to move up into towards zone. You can see them coming in from the western side. Team unknown holding up right on the edge. Mumu pushing in, pushing up on next level. Down goes Mumu. Warlord now coming in for the push, heading in. Third fight is all the way. Warlord about to get hit. Just managing to drop down, but Hitman takes him out. Beautifully done. So now we have Collision Course going up against the players here from next level. Let's see, will they be able to get this chicken dinner? Collision Course sitting on 6 kills. We got next level on 17 kills. So will next level end up with 20 kills or will we have Collision Course finishing their play on 8? Let's find out. Let's find out. So next level now getting ready with the smoke, sending it up all over the place. Ooh, we got a few heads coming in over towards Hitman. You can see Ghost and Josh getting ready to push. Oh, what a grin there by Josh. Gets the hit on BTS. Up comes Ghost getting ready to push in now. Come on. And the network goes all wonky right there. Come on, who's going to get it? Oh, and just like that, they land the final blows. Well done.
What's up guys? Welcome back. All right, here we go getting into our second game for the night. This of course being the match between uh, Zimbabwe and Tanzania. All right, so as you can see we are on the Sanok map. Let's have a quick look at the teams that we got in the lobby. So we got the players of course there from um, the African squad over in slot 2. We got Overwatch over in slot 3. We got the players from Tete Mombasa in slot 4. We've got the Hawks over in slot 5. We got the Reapers or the Titans, sorry, Titans over in slot 6. In slot 7, we've got the Eliminators in 8. We've got the team there from the African Beasts. We got Flashy over in slot 9. In 10, we've got the Knights. Uh, we got Esports Zim over in slot soon. 11. Be prepared. We got the Dark Squad over in slot 12. In 13, we've got ESL Zimbabwe. In 14, we've got the players there from iRobot. And of course, in 15, we've got the Hunters. So as you can see, the flight bot there is taking us from Nakawi and heading straight over towards Tambang. So let's see, let's see. Hopefully, um, well, this might be a very interesting match seeing that we're on such a small map. So the teams will definitely get, well, run into each other. Um, fairly quickly uh, early on in the game with several teams of course now dropping out over quarry so they might all start pushing up in the direction there of boot camp or even paradise so let's see let's see hopefully we can jump in and uh, get in on that action so let me know in the chat who do you guys think uh, is going to get the chicken dinner for this round but several teams making their way across man this is going to be insane so the players there from the African squad touching down over in boot camp. We've got the dark squad just passing over paradise as well as the players there from Tete Mombasa. So the team of course there from iRobot going straight for Painan. So the hot drop places are not really that hot today. Doesn't seem like anyone's really pushing up on that. But of course now we've got the players here from Esports Zim. And a few t other teams also now making their push right off in that direction. So let's jump in while we wait for them to touch down. Let's just try and cycle through here. You can see the squad already from Esports Zim on the ground. Shots flying across right over towards the Titans. So Maysam is now the last hope for left. We also have the players there from um, the Eliminators pushing in as well. Maysam tapping off a few shots. So let's see, let's see. Hopefully, hopefully we can get in on some more action elsewhere on the map. Just keeping an eye on these teams that we've got over here, of course, now. We've got teams up at um, Hatin as well, making their way around. Let's try and see if we can jump over to Hatin to get in on that action. There we go. Shots now flying up, flying right past the players here from Esports Zim. We've got Maysam, of course, now getting ready to move out off to the side there. Oh, nicely done. Psycho getting hit. So Hitman, Hot Ticked, Lord Leo and the Hunter now all pushing up. Everyone jumping at the same spot. Nicely done. Lord Leo going in for the hit there. Quick thirst. There we go. Maniac and Savage now the last two hopefuls left. Hitman now moving up once again. There we go Savage. Oh, just keeping a watch for eye there. Hitman trying to turn the corner. Hopefully he was trying to uh, get the head as he jumps around. Let's see the hunter now moving up as well. We've got Maniac and Savage just upstairs lying in wait. So Lord Leo now getting ready to push in his jump over to Maniac. See what's going to happen. He's covering the stairs. Up they come getting the hits in. Savage now pushing out. Oh, shooting, running out of ammo, reloading in such a tough spot. There we go, Savage making his quick escape, but gets taken out by Lord Leo. Well done, well played. Just like that, it is done. Let's jump over to the players, of course, here now from the Dark Squad. They're pushing up on the team there from Tete Mombasa. And, of course, we've got the players from um, the African Beast, of course, now on the side here as well. The players there from Overwatch just over towards their southeast. So let's see if we can maybe just reposition a little bit here to try and get in on that action. Maysam still alive, making a run. 
because the hunters and the team there from ESL Zimbabwe they might just bump into each other anytime soon so let's jump over here to devil see what he's getting up to is of course now just keeping his eyes open waiting for someone to come over the hill you can see overwatch just in front of them there so the dark squad now making a run for it we got Uso was the only player um, left there for the team there from the dark squad Tete Mombaza of course now just making their way through let's see if we can jump up into some more action the players there from the Knights over in Camp Charlie so let's see let's see let's jump over here to overwatch see what they're getting up to they're of course now making their way in the direction of the hunters that we've got lying in wait we got Tech Raider now moving in. You can just hear the shots. He's going to bump straight into Devil. Devil. Oh, lying in wait. One hit. We got Didza now also trying to move in. No helmet just yet. Only a mutant. Let's see. Kill shot also right there, just below them. So, kill shot now moving up with a vector. Oh, there we go, Hunter on the outside. Oh, down goes Trick Shot. For some other odd reason, Quick Shot was struggling with his vector. Oh, Didza now the last hopeful left here for Overwatch. The Hunter team, of course, now in full force, just lying in wait, hoping he pushes up towards them. We got Burhang now just there on the opposite end. We got uh, by G now also just going for swim. That's a strange place to go swimming. Let's jump over to Burhang again. Hopefully he pushes up. He could quick shot bleeding out slowly but surely. Let's see Devil also just keeping a watchful eye. They're waiting to see if someone's going to push up to get the res. But Didza not doing that. And kill shot gets taken out. Well done. So Hunter now sitting on three kills. Let's see if we've got any action elsewhere on the map. Oh, we might see the remainder of the Hunter team now getting hit there by the players further up north. Let's try and jump. I think it's a uh, Baji. No. Ranjari. There we go. So we've got Ranjari now on the side. The players there, of course, from the Hawks moving in. Let's see. Will Hunter wing it and get the hit on the, on the players there from the Hawks? No idea. But they're getting really, really close. I don't think he not he's noticed them. He's going to hear the shots. They're going to run right up behind him. Oh, up they come. Just, just there on him. You can see Gamer just moving past now. So Ranjari not moving too much. Just trying it to stay out in, well, behind the rock there. Not to get spotted. we got Phenomenal also right there with him as well. So let's see Didza still creeping around. Will they get the hits? So phenomenal and uh, Tutuka. No, no, no. I'm going. I'm guessing. <laughs> Let's see. We've got a few more teams also now moving up. Oh, there we go. So by G. Getting hit. Let's see. Will, will we see a hit here? There we go, Gamer getting that first on by G as well. We got Anjari, Burhang, Devil. Let's see, let's see. Come on, come on, come on. No other teams pushing up on each other aside from the ones that we've got on screen at the moment. We got the African uh, Beast now also moving up from the north onto the position here where we've got the players there from the Hawks. So Didza just uh, dirtying up his clothes. Let's see, we've got the African squad now moving in. African beast rather. Up they come, pushing up through the blue zone. Definitely going to run into the team here from the Hawks that we've got lying in wait. Here we go, they spotted them. Ah, oh, nice! Ranjari getting, stealing the kill there. What? 
Getting the knock and the kill. Beautifully done. So the African beast now trying to move up. Let's see. Will they push up on um, Ranjari? Ooh, there we go. He's got a green flying his way. Oh, nice. Are getting hit. Ooh, there we go. We got some action with the African squad in the kill feed as well. Now pushing up on the flashy teams. I'm just going to leave the angle here. Let's jump over to the players over here in boot camp. They're, of course, now pushing across. There we go. Flashy getting hit in the process. Hunter getting taken out. Well done. Well played. Let's see where the remainder of the squad is. So we've got Devil now still moving up. Let's see Dr. Blue. Right here next to the players there from Flashy. We've got Maysam, of course, just on the opposite side. So I think Flashy might be down to one. Let's see, is Dr. Blue going to get the hit? Oh, there we go. Didza finally getting taken out by Devil. Well done. So Hunter now on five kills. Let's see, will Flashy, of course, now survive against the players there from the African squad? We might see the Hawks now once again getting pushed. Just going to jump over to Maysam and company. Dr. Blue getting taken out. What a hit. Quick first, of course, now by Flashy. 2004 being the last one left. We've got Maysam now moving up just in front of Gamer here. Oh, come on. Take the shot. Take the shot. No, and he doesn't. Ah, that was so close. That was so, so close. So Maysam, of course, now still just running up in towards zone. We saw S12K getting taken out a little while ago. So let's see. Will we get a, a clutch play here from Flashy? We got Tete Mambaza, of course, just off in the distance there, up ahead of Maysam. We've got a few other teams, of course, now moving into the area as well. Oh, Flashy trying to rotate up, but getting hit in the process. So the African squad not letting him go just yet. Let's see, will Maysam survive? Heading straight over towards Tete Mambaza. We've got killers, of course, right in front of Maysam. Come on, you can do it. There we go. Come, Maysam, you can do it. You can do it. Do it for the Titans. Trying to third party peek and figure out where the other players are. Come on, that's such an easy hit. Nicely done. There we go. First hit. Well played to Maysam. Up comes Killer now. Oh, come on, you can do it. Come on, Maysam. Show us what you got. Show us what you got. Ah, you got the lobby. That's what. <laughs> well done to Tete. And the African squad as well. Taking out both the opponents on both sides there. You can see the African squad now tapping off a few shots. Over towards the players there from the Hawks. So we have now pushing up on them as well. So Gamer and Phenomenal now. The last two hopefuls left. Phenomenal of course right up in front of them. Sending a few grins across. We got A just holding up behind the rock here. Gamer and Phenomenal of course just in front of them there. We got I going up for rotation. Gamer getting hit in the process. Phenomenal is now the last hopeful left. Ooh A getting hit as well. Third party shots flying in. Gamer getting thirsted. Let's see. Is Phenomenal going to engage there right there? No. Took too long. And down they go. Tete, of course, now also trying to push up in towards zone. The African beast firing off a few shots over towards Tete as well. So we've got Tete on the left-hand side. African beast with just now here on the right-hand side. So we are left with nine teams. We've got the players, of course, there from iRobot. Busy looting it up over in Ruins. We've got the team there from uh, the Eliminators making their way just through Pinan. The team, of course, from the Dark Squad just pushing up in to Quarry Zone. We've got the Knights all the way in the south. And the players there from ESL Zimbabwe, of course, now also just holding up their position. We've got the African Squad now getting ready to push out up in towards Zone. Rotating out of Boot Camp. We might even see the players here from the African Beast fire away a few shots. So Tete still making the push for zone. Let's see. Hopefully they might even run into the players there from Dark Squad. It's going to be a def definite interesting one to see. But hopefully, hopefully we're going to see a bit of action here. 
We've got KLS2 just off in the distance there. A now really trying to catch up with the blue zone. Manages to do so just in time. Because blue zone is on the move once again. K now getting a quick hit in on R. Oh, there we go. A getting hit as well. Reviver tapping off a few shots. Let's jump over. You can see all the teams now rushing up into a zone. So A quickly managing to boost. We got F coming in. Blue zone putting an end to R. So Reviver of course now pushing in as well. Let's see. Will they get the hit? So the ones we got playing now is Zimbabwe and Tanzania. Let's see. Tete going up for wide, wide flank. Blue zone just coming in as well. There we go. A few shots now going off. Who's the one that's firing off? No, I think it's Killers. There we go. Yes, Killers. See him now just keeping an eye there on the players from the African squad. Just in front of them there. LS2 just holding up behind the tree. We also have the players now from the Eliminators up in front of... Ah, <laughs> nice. Up in front of the team here from the African Beasts. So let's see, let's see. Will they get it? They're of course now pushing over towards the action. There we go. African squad moving up. LS2 getting hit. Wrath putting him all the way... Well, sending him all the way back to the lobby. Let's see. Will African K manage to survive? Going up again to the squad there from Tete Mombaza. Definitely has to move up in towards zone. Can't stay in the blue for too long. We've got Reviver just waiting on the other side of this rock. There we go. Nicely done by K. Gets the hit on Reviver. A and company, of course, now. Just keeping a watchful eye on the Hunters pushing up on their position. Tete Mambaza swooping in. Now setting up a gatekeep there. Waiting for K to move in. Here we go. So K now rotating up. Oh, there we go. Hunter getting hit as well. Nice. A pushing straight up to Burhang there. But getting knocked out in the process. We still have Devil left. And there we go. Tete Mombaza sending them all back to the lobby. Tete Mombaza now rotating up as well. We got the Dark Squad still lying in wait here. I going in for the first there. A now moving up as well. We still have F left. F just getting hit by the Dark Side. Dark Squad. We got Uzo now going in, getting a quick thirst as well, putting them back in the lobby. Let's jump over to the team here from the Eliminators. They're of course now tapping away several shots all over the place. As Tete Mambaza is now trying to make their push for zone. We got the Dark Squad also just off to the side there. Hunter now moving in, getting hit. Hitman and company pushing up. There we go, trying to go in for the first. We got uh, Dosa just up on the hill here. Let's see, will Dosa get a final play? No, he gets taken out. Well done to Tete Mombaza. Several shots, of course, now going off over here. So let's go in to the single view if it allows me to. There we go. Man, well done. The players here from the Eliminators getting several shots. As you can see, all the teams that were trying to push up Tete Mombaza getting taken out in the process. Um, the African squad getting taken out. We still have one left for the African beasts. So the players here from the Eliminators staying true to their name. Oh, there we go. We've got a few more shots going off as well. Let's jump over here to ESL Zim. They're of course now pushing up the hill. we got lowercase i just making it, a, making it up in towards zone. Oh, there we go. A few shots now flying off the Knights. Busy battling it out with the team there. Um, no, it's not the Knights. We've got ESL battling it out, of course, now with the teams right in front of them there. Let's see. The Knights, are they going to get the hits? Busy healing up in the process. So we got 1998 getting taken down. we got Revenge just managing to get in some health there. Nor now trying to push up. Oh, what a grin. Let's jump up further in towards zone. Keeping an eye on the Knights here. As you can see, we've got several players already getting knocked out. The team, of course, now here from iRobot. Going at it, putting some herd into the players all across the map. 
Ooh, Zoom getting a beautiful hit in as well. 1998 is up and added once again. Let's jump over to Zoom. See him pushing in. Gets knocked out. We got Nor and Death. The last two hopefuls left. We are left now with a very, very select few teams. Uh, six in total now remaining. Death now might be the last one left. Unless, left, of course. Unless he gets the res in on Zoom. It's flashy just getting taken out now in the background. Down goes Death. Death and No. Ooh, will it will no be able to make it? Death just getting taken by the blue zone. Everyone, of course, now pushing up. The players of, yeah, from iRobot keeping a watchful eye. And there we go. No getting it taken out by the blue zone. Deadly as ever. Let's jump over to the team here from the dark side. Hopefully, they're going to start fighting it out. Let's jump over to the player, of course, here from the African Beast as well. There we go. Nice. Some shots now flying up there from Jaff. Jaff and Medi, the two players left. So you can see the dark squad now just holding up behind the rock. Trying to get the angle there on the players from the Eliminators. Oh, Jaff. Nicely done. We've got Medi now fighting, firing off as well. We've got I now running up in towards zone. There we go. Up comes I now pushing up for a flank. Medi getting a quick hit and as well hot, uh, hot tick now just managing to heal up in the process. Let's see, will I make it all the way up behind the players here from I Robot? Everyone now pushing in. You can do it. Oh, look at the shots. Medi getting knocked out. Jaff now the last hope for left. I moving in. Getting a beautiful hit there on Toxic Love. But he runs right in to the squad. Right in the middle of them. There we go. So we got Medi now coming back in for the res. Ooh, the players there from the Eliminators tapping off a few shots. Medi on the wrong side of that rock. Down goes I as well. We are left now with three teams. So we've got the players, of course, now on the right-hand side with being the iRobots. We've got the Dark Squad on the side. Oh, Hitman getting knocked out. So Vape and Solid. The two players still up and able. Let's see, got a few greens, of course, now flying across here from, from Dark. Jeff. Oh, there we go. We are left with Lord Leo. Lord Leo is now the last hopeful. Shots flying in. Oh, and down he goes. Well done. Jaff putting him back to sleep. We got Snake, of course, now just quickly getting the res on the remainder of his team. Three of them, two of them getting knocked out, rather. Toxic and um, Whip. So let's see, will Jaff be able to get us a clutch? Blue zone moving in. Ooh, this is going to be a risky move. Shots now flying up. Oh, there we go. Some hits. Oh, move, move, move. Blue zone. And it is the end. Well done. Well played. So there we go. There we have it. That is the end of our second game for the day. The players there, of course, now um, from... Man, I forgot their names now. Who's this? I think this is... Man, I can't remember. But well done to, to Pweb, Toxic Love, Vape and Solid. Beautifully done. We got the players there from the Dark Squad coming in second place. The team here from... I think that was... Uh, well, Hitman and Company. It really helps if you guys have your tags on. I think it might have been the Eliminators. Um, coming in third place, Lord Leo, Hot Tech, Hitman, and Hunter. Then, of course, we've got the players here from the African squad coming in second place. Um, we've got the Knights in fourth place. We've got ESL um, Zimbabwe, I think, yeah, finishing off in sixth place. Hunters in seventh. Tete Mombaza in eighth place. Then, of course, we've got the African squad over in uh, the African Beast. 
the, or the other way around. Which are, no, this is this is the Titans. There we go. Nope, this is squad. My bad. It's difficult to figure it out without the appropriate tags there. We've got the Hawks finishing off in 10th place. Flashy in 11th place. Then we've got the Titans in 12th place. Overwatch in 13th place. And of course, um, we've got the players there. Savage, Psycho, Maniac, and uh, Nojir finishing off. I think that might have been... Well, I can't remember who that was, but they finished off in 14th place. So well done, well played. Um, yep, there we go. That is the end of our second game. Let's get into the intermission while we wait for our second round or third round to get underway. So we're just now here on the right-hand side. So we are left with nine teams. We got the players, of course, there from iRobot. Busy looting it up over in Ruins. We got the team there from uh, the Eliminators making their way just through Pinan. The team, of course, from the Dark Squad just pushing up into Quarry Zone. We've got the Knights all the way down in the south. And the players there from ESL Zimbabwe, of course, now also just holding up their position. We've got the African Squad now getting ready to push out up in towards Zone, rotating out of boot camp. We might even see the players here from the African Beast fire away a few shots. So Tete still making the push for Zone. Let's see. Hopefully, they might even run into the players there from Dark Squad. It's going to be a def definite interesting one to see. But hopefully, hopefully we're going to see, see a bit of action here. So we got K, LS2, just off in the distance there. A, now really trying to catch up with the Blue Zone. Manages to do so just in time. Because Blue Zone is on the move once again. K now getting a quick hit in on R. Oh, there we go. A getting hit as well. Reviver tapping off a few shots. Let's jump over. You can see all the teams now rushing up into a zone. So A quickly managing to boost. We got F coming in. Blue zone putting an end to R. So Reviver, of course, now pushing in as well. Let's see. Will they get the hit? So the ones we got playing now is Zimbabwe and Tanzania. Let's see, Tete going up for wide, wide flank. Blue zone just coming in as well. There we go, a few shots now going off. Who's the one that's firing off? No, I think it's Killers. There we go, yes, Killers. See him now just keeping an eye there on the players from the African squad. Just in front of them there. LS2 just holding up behind the tree. We also have the players now from the Eliminators up in front of... Ah, <laughs> nice. Up in front of the team here from the African Beasts. So let's see, let's see. Will they get it? They're of course now pushing over towards the action. There we go. African squad moving up. LS2 getting hit. Wrath putting him all the way... Well, sending him all the way back to the lobby. Let's see. Will African K manage to survive? Going up against the squad there from Tete Mombaza. Definitely has to move up in towards zone. Can't stay in the blue for too long. We've got Reviver just waiting on the other side of this rock. There we go. Nicely done by K. Gets the hit on Reviver. A and company of course now. Just keeping a watchful eye on the Hunters pushing up on their position. Tete Mombaza swooping in. Now setting up a gatekeep there. Waiting for K to move in. Here we go, so K now rotating up. Oh, there we go, Hunter getting hit as well. Nice! A pushing straight up to Burhang there, but getting knocked out in the process. We still have Devil left, and there we go. Tete Mombaza sending them all back to the lobby. Tete Mombaza now rotating up as well. We got the Dark Squad still lying in wait here. I going in for the first there. A now moving up as well. We still have F left. F just getting hit by the Dark Side. Dark Squad. We got Uzo now going in. Getting a quick thirst as well. Putting them back in the lobby. Let's jump over to the team here from the Eliminators. They of course now tapping away several shots all over the place. As Tete Mombaza is now trying to make their push for zone. We've got the Dark Squad also just off to the side there. Hunter now moving in, getting hit. Hitman and company pushing up. There we go, trying to go in for the first. we got uh, Dosa just up on the hill here. 
Let's see, will Dasa get a final play? No, he gets taken out. Well done to Tete Mombaza. Several shots, of course, now going off over here. So let's go in to the single view if it allows me to. There we go. Man, well done. The players here from the Eliminators getting several shots. As you can see, all the teams that were trying to push up. Tete Mombaza getting taken out in the process. Um, the African squad. We still have one left for the African Beasts. So the players here from the Eliminators staying true to their name. Oh, there we go. We've got a few more shots going off as well. Let's jump over here to ESL Zim. They're of course not pushing up the hill. We got lowercase i just making it a, making it up in towards zone. Oh, there we go. A few shots now flying off the knights. Busy battling it out with the team there. Um, well, it's not the knights. We got ESL battling it out, of course, now with the teams right in front of them there. Let's see. The knights, are they going to get the hits? Busy healing up in the process. So we got 1998 getting taken down. We got Revenge just managing to get in some health there. Nor now trying to push up. Oh, what a grin. Let's jump up further in towards zone. Keeping an eye on the Knights here. As you can see, we've got several players already getting knocked out. The team, of course, now here from iRobot. Going at it, putting some herd into the players all across the map. Ooh, Zoom getting a beautiful hit in as well. 1998 is up and added once again. Let's jump over to Zoom. See him pushing in. Gets knocked out. We got Null and Death. The last two hopefuls left. We are left now with a very, very select few teams. Uh, six in total now remaining. Death now might be the last one left. Unless, left, of course. Unless he gets the res in on Zoom. It's flashy just getting taken out now in the background. Down goes Death. Death and No. Ooh, will it will No be able to make it? Death just getting taken by the blue zone. Everyone, of course, now pushing up. The players here from iRobot keeping a watchful eye. And there we go. No getting it taken out by the blue zone. Deadly as ever. Let's jump over to the team here from the dark side. Hopefully they're going to start fighting it out. Let's jump over to the player, of course, here from the African Beast as well. There we go. Nice. Some shots now flying up there from Jaff. Jaff and Medi, the two players left. So you can see the dark squad now just holding up behind the rock. Trying to get the angle there on the players from the Eliminators. Oh, Jeff. Nicely done. Let's see. We've got Medi now fighting, firing off as well. We've got I now running up in towards zone. There we go. Up comes I now pushing up for a flank. Medi getting a quick hit and as well Heart, uh, heart Tick now just managing to heal up in the process. Let's see. Will I make it all the way up behind the players here from iRobot? Everyone now pushing in. Come on. You can do it. Oh, look at the shots. Medi getting knocked out. Jaff now the last hope for left. I moving in. Getting a beautiful hit there on Toxic Love. But he runs right into the squad. Right in the middle of them. There we go. So we got Medi now coming back in for the res. Ooh, the players there from the Eliminators tapping off a few shots. Medi on the wrong side of that rock. Down goes I as well. We are left now with three teams. So we got the players, of course, now on the right-hand side with being the iRobots. we got the Dark Squad on the side. Oh, Hitman getting knocked out. So Vape and Solid. The two players still up and able. Let's see. got a few greens, of course, now flying across here from, from Dark. Jeff. Oh, there we go. We are left with Lord Leo. Lord Leo is now the last hopeful. Shots flying in. Oh, and down he goes. Well done. Jeff putting him back to sleep. 
We got Snake, of course, now just quickly getting the res on the remainder of his team. Three of them, two of them getting knocked out, rather. Toxic and um, Web. So let's see, will Jaff be able to get us a clutch? Blue zone moving in. Ooh, this is going to be a risky move. Shots now flying up. Oh, there we go. Some hits. Oh, move, move, move. Blue zone. And it is the end. Well done. Well played. Looks like we've come to the end of the road. There's nobody running away now. Rather sleep until the storm is over. She'd rather be shooting at me now. I know it will end up in anger. I don't think we grew up, we just became older. She's aiming her words, ready to fire. I don't think that bullets will bring back desire. Like a blink of an eye's not enough She'd rather be staying for days now I'd rather fix it than mess up again She'd rather be burning it all now I know we will end up in anger I don't think we grew up, we just became older She's aiming her words, ready to fire I don't think that bullets will bring back desire I don't think that bullets will bring back desire
Welcome What's up PUBG guys? Mobile. Welcome back. All right, here we go getting into our third game of the night. As you can see, we've got a few more teams once again. We are back on a wrangle this time. So let's have a look at the teams that we've got in the lobby. This game, of course, being the one between Madagascar and South Africa. All right, so let's have a look. We've got the players there from um, the Gassi squad over in slot two. We've got Ikasi in slot three. In four, we've got Fap Unity in five. We've got the players there from Pride in six. We've got Saint. We've got the real deal over in slot seven. Uh, we've got the striker squad over in a uh, striker team rather. Sorry, in slot eight. Uh, we've got Bicycle Bros over in slot nine. We've got the Mofo crew over in slot ten. We've got Gun in slot eleven. OPC in twelve. We've got Phoenix over in 13. We've got Team Zanetti over in slot 14. Resurrection Undead over in 15. And then, of course, the players there from New Kudai over in slot 16. So as you can see the flight path there taking us from just south of Georgia Pool. And, of course, heading over towards the military island. So giving the players there quite a nice uh, few jumps or spots to drop in. So let's see how they do, where they go. And hopefully we can jump in to some action early on in the game. And now we just wait and see who's going where. As you can see, we already have a few teams now pushing up towards Georgia Pole. So hopefully we can jump across over to that. And uh, yeah, maybe get into some early game action there. We've got Ikasi making their way down. Mofo crew also heading out. The real deal heading for the usual spot right over in South George. We might see BKB. Yes, there we go. They're going straight for Pachinki as per usual. We've got Ikasi also dropping just on the southern edge of the mountain there. So let's see. Hopefully we can jump up. Going to jump over here to BKB. So we can get in on some of that. We've got Ikasi now also about to start a fight there. With the players from the MoFo crew. Well, depending on which way MoFo goes. So you've got Zeus and company already touching down now in Pachinki as you can see. The MoFo crew also now just heading up. Just waiting for them, well, for this map to load in. So we can jump straight over towards them. There we go. So we got the Mofo crew on the left-hand side. BKB on the right-hand side, of course, pushing up. Now on the players there from Fap Unity. There's only two of them in that team. So you got Bad Boy and, of course, Aura there. Ooh, there we go. See? Ikasi already landing a few hits. There we go. Mofo getting hit in the process. Down goes Choco. Ah, bowl and sauce are the last two hopefuls left for the team. Up comes Ikasi and finishes them off. So we got the remainder of the squad, of course, just a little bit off in the distance. There you can see Mofo now just trying to make his way across. Bait, man, uh, some, so, uh, for some miraculous reason, managed to get up ahead of bowl. We got the Fab guys also now about to get pushed on the side over here by the team from Ika um, from BKB there, sorry. See Ikasi because I was looking at them. <laughs> Ooh, there we go. Nicely done. So Ikasi making their way across. Heading up towards center zone, which we have for this round, all the way up towards the north. So let's see if we can jump into some other potential action.